Welcome. We are Real Juicy News and we today have some really shocking news. Just came in about an hour ago and it reads ECE teacher force feed toddlers made racist and insulting comments. This is news from New Zealand and a New Zealand child care centre. The Whangarei, that's a district up in the North Island of New Zealand, manager of an early childhood centre has had her teacher's registration cancelled by the Teachers Disciplinary Tribunal amid a string of misconduct charges covering inappropriate use of force, inappropriate comments and force feeding incidents. The Tribunal this week released its decision on Sonia K. Costello, having heard about 11 specific incidents between February 2015 and July 2018 as well as a representative allegation of unprofessional and inappropriate conduct between 2009 and 2017. One incident saw Costello call a Maori child thick and say that this was what happens when your people are raped and pillaged. That's disgusting. What a horrid comment to say to a child. There were incidents of trying to force feed, including one which saw her shove a spoonful of broccoli into a child's mouth. Some children just don't like broccoli, so they shouldn't be forced to eat it. It's like a boring food anyway. It's one of the most boring vegetables. You've got to add cheese sauce to it or something. She states that child B started crying and coughed up a mouthful of chewed food, despite child B being visibly and clearly upset. The complainant states that the respondent told child B to go to bed in a belittling way and then proceeded to make disparaging comments about child B and his parents in front of others. Yeah, coward would, would say that in front of the parents, would you? Especially if they are Māori. She, also, well, she was also accused of roughly dropping a toddler, grabbing their arms and using her foot to push the child to sit down and calling it another crying child pathetic. The tribunal said Costello had been served with the proceedings but had not taken an active role. Despite the absence of the respondent, the tribunal must still be satisfied on the balance of probabilities that the alleged factual incidents occurred, the tribunal wrote. The cancer cost registration in consensus of her. Okay, so she won't be doing that anymore, hopefully. Um, but here, this, this is, what the hell is this? The tribunal said Costello had been served with the proceedings but had not taken an active role. It just said up here, she's the one doing all the abuse, showing the remarks and treating the child with contempt and saying all those horrible things while probably other ch children were looking on. And okay, some other children might cry because, you know, they understand, like, that's their friend or whatever, you know. They get along with that kid. They, have not, they don't have many of those problems unless they're taught by their parents who are biased, racist or whatever to talk the same way act the same way this is just not on okay we, we don't wish it upon married children Pacific Island children white children Chinese children anything like that okay these people are in a position of responsibility and this person abused it so this person should be charged with assault abuse etc never work in that kind of environment ever again. This we are saying because it should apply to all New Zealand children, all parents of children. Yeah. No one should be able to say to their child and yeah, force their child to eat something they didn't like. Yeah. Or have this mental abuse. These these this crap here thrown at them, right? Okay, when it's just not true. Yeah. Okay, so that's real juicy news. We are real juicy news, and that's like really unjuicy news, right? We don't like that sort of thing. We don't put up that sort of thing. If we see it, we will take it action, right? Okay, it doesn't matter if you're. Married child, Pacific Island, or a white child, European child, or an immigrant's child, right? 
we're all New Zealanders, we're all Kiwis. Stop the crap where we are all one, all this sort of crap, all these mottos, all these songs saying we are all one, we are all Kiwis, we are all New Zealand. We need to let this kind of thing go down. Okay, so we're Real Juicy News and we hope you, in a sense, liked this particular news report and the report by this woman's incident in a place or position and she totally abused it uh, if you did it's waking you up to what the hell these kind of things are actually going on and I wonder how my child is <laughs> day to day if I put them in a child care centre right? that's probably why they play up or they're very upset or something. something's gone down in there right? yeah so subscribe to our channel add your comments below the video don't forget to give us a like. Tell us all about your experiences with your children in different child care centres. We know this sort of thing goes on because we ex-partner her child was going to this lady who came out when we picked her up and says, Oh, she's must be retarded or something, she's not all there or something. And like which made me really upset because it's not my child, but you don't talk to a child like that, so I said to the woman the partner at the time. No, not going back there. No, no. You ever bring her back here, I'll burst your tyres or something like that, right? Pull the parts out of your car. And another one, well, my own personal child, my own child, went to a Indian lady and, well, the same child, right? Because I was like a stepfather too. And this lady says, oh, she's not all there, retarded and all that sort of stuff. And it's like, well, she ain't coming back here either. It's just the child was a little bit slower, you yeah? She was, there was nothing wrong with her, just, she just didn't pick up on things for us, like when she was learning to ride a bike. Yeah? The, um, the youngest child got on it and phew, she was gone. Yeah? Had the safety was on whatever, but the other one wasn't too sure what to do. Right? Had to move her feet and all that sort of stuff, but she was being taught, but she just didn't pick up on it real fast, yeah? She's probably a deep thinker or something like that, you know. Took a time of thinking about it, like trying to work it out what was being said, right? The other one just picked it up real fast and boom, she was gone. Yeah, okay, so subscribe to our channel. Give us a like. Add your comments below the video. Uh, we'd be most interested in those. How appalled a lot of New Zealanders will be over this woman's conduct. And um, then go share this with all your family, friends and others.